Good morning, everyone. No? Okay. Welcome back to my channel. For those of you that are new and if you're coming back, welcome. Hello. How are you guys? I have not vlogged or recorded for a while. Today we're going to go on a little... Not even a field trip. I'm gonna go over to my sister's house because she says that uh, yesterday she, when my mom went to go drop her off at her house, there was someone parked in her, like in the front of her driveway because it's here and then you go down to go further down into her house. There was someone parked and they picked up a package. And it wasn't like, it was a random car. It wasn't one of the cars that live with her because where she lives, there's like the main house, like a studio house and then a secondary studio house. And there's like four different cars, but anyways, that one wasn't part of the little group. That's where they live. So she asked, me and my mom if we could go check her house to see if the package came so that way we can leave it in her husband's truck or by her front door I might put it in the barbecue but yeah today is the last day of angel school and then it's summer vacation starting tomorrow it's been crazy it's crazy crazy 2020 but I'm so excited Angel is finally done with school. They said that he's been doing really, really good. So I'm super, super excited. He's hit all the goals that, well, he's hit some of the goals that they've put for him. So that's really exciting to know. I get a progress report every quarter, if I'm not mistaken. So, um, I'm excited. It was fun. And then he also got a haircut. My baby looks so cute. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. I look toda folona because I woke up. I mean, I woke up at 9. But still, toda And I got new glasses. I'm so excited. I got new glasses. I got them from Glasses USA. And they were having um, a sale. It was... 60% off the sun, the glasses or of the frames I should say and then I was like oh, I'll get two so I got two pairs for $140 so I was like oh, that's not bad because it's two pairs of glasses because I had two pairs but the frames were really thick on my first ones when I got my second glasses. The frames were a little bit thinner. But my first pair with the thick frames, they, they're they so scratched. Like there's a fat scratch coming down the line on my right side. So I, it, it freaks me out. And then my second pair of glasses, they have tiny scratches on them on both lenses. And I clean them like every so often because like I'm always like touching my face or like you know moving my glasses up that I'll sometimes touch it with my skin or angel sometimes when he'll hug me he'll put like his cheek on my on my lens so I I clean them and I noticed 
that it had tons of scratches and I was like no wonder it looks dirty to me because my lenses are scratched so it looks like they're dirty but they're not they're just scratched and I was like so I saved up some money and I got to my frames so excited I've never had this style of a frame before so super exciting so I just got to my sister's house I don't see anything there's no package there because I just saw Amazon Prime no package there and no package here interesting well um i'm trying to work out every day but girl it's a struggle people it's a it's a huge struggle to work out every day and then I also got myself an Apple Watch so that way I can keep track of all my workouts, keep track of like how much I'm working out, especially when we go walk this big hill by the Burger King that's in my house. <sighs> Girl, I almost died during that hike. I'm gonna see if we go again. I'm, <laughs> I'm gonna try and record. <laughs> You're gonna hear me going. <sighs> that's me, right? Mama was dying. That was dying. But it'll be worth it. I'm gonna be a skinny mini. After the summer or during the summer, so watch out. So I might record some more during the day. I don't know, we'll see. If not, I'll probably just do my outro. Uh, a toy too. Good morning everyone and welcome back to my channel. This is going to be I think a two part vlog video thing I'm going to do. Um, I'm super full. I just had breakfast. <clears throat> so I am just going to do my makeup real quick, fix my hair because I made a full of Alunga, and then I'm gonna vlog the rest of the day today. And then I might show you guys a chicken coop that um, one of our brothers from church is helping my mom build. So it'll be an exciting day. I will catch you guys once this face is all well done and beat. Well, sort of. Well, I finished my makeup. And we also, well, I finished my makeup, like, what, three hours ago? But I had to go do ochata to make to drink for the food. But someone decided to give me a heart attack. And he basically split open his forehead because he was running from our kitchen through the laundry room to go outside to go help with the kitchen coop. Oops. And so I will. Oh, I had a heart. A heart. No, you bite it. Yeah. Oh, this is mine. Okay. I had a heart attack. He he split it like right here, and he he was bleeding so bad. I I grabbed the paper towel and I just told my mom to put it on his forehead, and then like I grabbed a towel. And I put it on his forehead and I was freaking out. I was shaking. I, I didn't know if I should like scream, cry, freak out. I didn't know what the hell to do. So my mom ended up taking us to the emergency room. We went to the emergency room. And I wait. Okay, so I and I turned my time. Hold on. And they put I a said little bit. Doctors. <laughs> yeah, we went to the doctors. They put a little bit of like not it wasn't cream it was like oil inside of the wound because it, it was open it was like that big 
or so. It was like, it was pretty big and like, raspaba todo acá. Oh my God. Le pusieron eso. They put a little bit of cotton on it with like, um, I Coban. Them on oh yeah. There's like blood still there that we have to clean up. Um, yeah. Mm -hmm. And they put Coban to kind of keep it in place to not have the cotton ball move. Almost like 25 minutes went by. She said that it was going to take for it to numb up the inside of the wound. So I was like, okay, cool. And then they came in, gave him a little bit of more meds. To numb him up more he tried to watch tv and he did for a little bit but afterwards he started freaking out after the second stitch started to get placed and he just lost it he was like mom mom hug me i was like okay but Gracias a Dios, it was just three stitches, and now he has a minion band-aid on him. Um, we came to grocery outlet because I told him I would buy him some ice cream. Because he did so good. He didn't even cry when he first, like, hit himself. Like, he literally... <laughs> he literally got up, started screaming like mom. He touched his head and saw the blood. He screamed even louder and like kind of like scream cried. If you like, if you know like what that means, I don't know how to explain it. And I grabbed a paper towel and like I put it on him. And my mom was holding in. I told her to put like pressure. And then like I I ran, grabbed my wallet, grabbed my keys, and I went. <laughs> my stuff down and I went to go get a towel uh una toalla like dura put that on his forehead with the freaking um paper towel and I was just like I was I was so like freaked out I was shaking I couldn't even talk I, it got to the point where like I was gonna start crying and I wasn't the one that smacked my head open so that was my Saturday so far how about yours How's your Saturday been? So we bought some ice cream. He's eating gushers for the first time. He doesn't really have candy. Wanna show him? He has all those cool bracelets to show off that he went to the hospital. Eat with your mouth closed. I'll see if I can try to insert, yeah, the gushers. <laughs> I'll see if I can try to insert some pictures of him. Um, I think I have pictures with the stitches on. Thank you. And I'll see you guys when we get home. I'll try to show you guys the chicken coop. But we'll see. <laughs> he will not move his forehead okay so the chicken coop is all done <laughs> and we brought all of because we have seven chickens we brought all of our seven chickens out and they love the coop that um oh, those hermanos built so I I'm, I don't think I'm gonna go inside because the boitos are outside but I'll just show you the outside of where they are right now. Sorry if it's a little windy. Or sorry if you can't hear me too well. It's a little bit windy. There we go. My papas. Hi, papas. Hi, papas. Hi, papas. Okay. I'm going to show you guys. Or do you want to show them? Yeah? Okay. I'm going to show you guys. So that's my baby. So this is what the chicken coop looks like. So it's pretty big. And it has a little doorknob up there. No, don't no, don't open it. It's kind of dusty. And this is what it looks like from the outside. Let me back up a little bit. 
So this is what it looks like. And then this is where the point will stay. I might show you guys some other time, but they ended up putting chicken wire here at the bottom because then they're gonna escaparse. But look, those are all the pollitos. And this one is Angel's because he's the grunt of the group. Of the group. <laughs> but this is basically our chicken coop. It looks nice, huh, baby? Mm -hmm. Okay, everybody. <laughs> Bye. So we're going to end the video here because I'm going to go help my mom with some other things in the yard and going to try to hurry up and finish so that we can spend some time with Bob Bush and watch some more movies because we're going to do a movie and popcorn night because he did such a good job at the hospital today so oh i'm sitting my thank you guys for watching thank you guys for tuning oh, my glasses for tuning in i will catch you guys in the next videos hopefully and say bye baby and papa says bye mommy say bye oh he already said bye <laughs> So don't forget to like and subscribe and I will see you guys with more videos.